Hello everyone. In this video, let's try to ask our playing cards about what do they think, feel, and tend towards you today, right now, this week. Um, I have four different decks. Number one, two, three, four. If you'd like to have this reading, please think of a person or persons and choose your deck or decks. And take your time, please. Okay, so let's start with our deck number one. Let's start with this deck. What do they think, feel, and tend towards you today? What does this person think of you? Well, thoughts are very good. They might think of you as very pretty, as very familiar, as they're happy with you and you're beautiful. Uh, they might think of you as being rich and even famous or maybe they uh, you are for them rich and famous so it's th these are very similar cards um of what one th would think of a wife as well you know someone related to the family someone looking very good you know wearing good clothes wearing good jewelry some pretty young lady and of course it can be um, someone younger um let's see yeah it doesn't have to be a wife of course it can be someone simply young and popular not like popular but liked by them um almost like you're the center of their world like they they like you yeah that sort of thing Also, my thing that you have everything in your life or almost everything that you're very well off financially and uh, that you have a very good family, that sort of thing. All cards are red, all cards are positive. But the most, the one that comes most to me is that you're attractive, you know, they're attractive, you're beautiful, you're young. Now, what do they feel about you? Um, you know they, they might feel about you it can be a little bit of some sort of jealousy issue it can be that um, they feel that you should maybe propose them or call them or something like that like you should chase them um, it can also show that uh, they think that you are with someone else in another relationship and so yeah I think they're jealous and I think they feel that maybe you have someone else and you're in another relationship you know you're interested in some older man you know and some other man um, and you might be having like a relationship with someone yeah there is a feeling also that you want they might want to call you or message you but they can't or something also it can talk about um attraction you know physical attraction here now let's uh, ask what are their intentions towards you today So most likely it is just sending an internet message or, or calling you or whatsapping or, or something like that. Because we have a very <clears throat> communication type of cards here. <clears throat> so I think it's about exchanging messages. So that's what is their intention. What is the advice for you regarding this person right now? Okay, so this person is flirting with you and if you like them, you can of course flirt back. This is a card that indicates love messages and that person is romantically interested in you. So it's up to you. Okay, so yeah, this person likes you. 
Okay, so this was our reading number one. Let's move on to our reading number two. Project number two. What do they think, feel, intend towards you right now? What do they think about you right now? Oh, so so there there is a little bit of black cards here. We can say that um, these cards might come out when, for example, you're not forgiving them, or um, these cards might mean that you're angry with them, or there is impossible to to meet you, and they want to meet you. The the there's missing something like missing wanting to contact but there's it's impossible there's pain something like that you know you can also you know talk yeah that they want to see you but they cannot and that's um there's a regret you know uh, connected to that There's also might be um, like you don't want to reconcile with them. You don't want to meet them again. Uh, that sort of feeling. If you're together, let's say you're living or something, these cards can show that this can show that you're not interested in things like sex. Let's see what do they feel about you. Oh, the cards are pretty black. I think they're, these cards would indicate like almost nothing. Uh, when the relationship has died out due to lack of communication or due to the lack of meetings, it can show that it's painful memories mostly and the person is avoiding you and they don't want to talk or, you know, there's just pain or something. So it's there's heavy feeling when they feel about you these feelings are black feelings are bad um or like long time back you know you were together now it's kind of over you know it's problematic so that's why these feelings are like that what are their intentions towards you So intentions are actually good. Uh, they uh, might uh, want to, um, I don't know, s send some money to your account, you know, or even to, um, let's say, they want to change things perhaps, you know, they, they have some sort of good idea. They might want to maybe uh, par have a partnership with you to, to do things with you. You can talk about some sort of... Uh, going to expensive place or buying something or simply trying to live with you the best they can or having good hopes for the future, you know, that sort of thing here. So it's very interesting because their intentions are very good, their feelings are kind of very dull, like numb. And... Uh, they maybe think that you're not in a mood or you're upset about something or you don't want to be with them or you're criticizing something always, you're depressed maybe sometimes, like that sort of thing. So they feel upset about it, of course. Uh, here's like they want to give something expensive to you, you know, like a gift or like a buy some new thing or give a favor to you or that sort of thing yeah like a buy a gift card or take you shopping or something like that okay so let's ask now what is advice what is advice for you regarding this person Well, it can talk about actually taking responsibility in your hands. Depending on the situation, um, it can point to, you know, uh, 
like you know you have to take more responsibilities uh in this relationship and in life i feel uh don't worry and uh, think about your goals and focus on your success wherever you're going um it's okay if you're sad or not in a mood or whatever right now if you're you know in the situation i think it's important to think about what you really want in life and chase it uh i think with this card also we get in a way ambition and some sort of career and moving forward in life but also if we talk about this relationship um so taking some sort of responsibility for this as well and uh, it can also point to things being too much things being like a burden you know in life um and that's why you're i don't know tired or whatever so so but i think it's a warning that it might be become even more busy in life and and something like that so you know maybe you can talk about your business with this person maybe you can somehow focus on the same thing that you're both interested in i don't know whether it's a travel whether it's some sort of success somewhere because he might be interested in offering you something similar so maybe they also care okay so this was our reading number two let's move on to our reading number three Reading number three. What do they think, feel, intend towards you right now? What do they think of you? Well, cards are very good. Um, they probably think that you're amazing. They, they like you. You're very popular, maybe surrounded by people. You're a very bright personality, very interesting. Um, lots of fans you have and friends and and family and that sort of stuff um so yeah this might think that you're always smiley you're always happy and things are going great for you that sort of situation it can be that they think you're rich as well you know you have your um, group of friends and uh, you're very active somewhere um, it can be online it can be somewhere else okay so what other feelings towards you wow you know it can be that uh, for a long time they've been in love with you, you know for a long time they've been trying to chase you down and it could be that they think it's been a long time since you were together like it's a long long time so it can be your husband and wife you know and uh they simply see you through the eyes that you're in a family you know that you're a very nice and perfect basically and uh, and yeah the feeling is like we've been for ages together you know we've been like long time ago and they want to be with you you know there is this um decision determination to be with you well this is a crush reading so Maybe the if it's a crush, then maybe they think you've uh, they've been having a crush on you for um, for a long time, or you've been having a crush on them for a long time. But it seems like you know, like you want to do something about you. They want to chase you also. If you're a female, yeah. If they are male. It can be that they uh, think you're chasing them, okay? So, what is their intentions towards you? What are their intentions? 
as you can see the the ones despite of not being together uh, because i don't know your schooling is over or there is some bad luck that doesn't allow you to be together <clears throat> they totally want to be together again they want to see you they want to meet you so the intentions um here doesn't show like action the type of thing like they are going to call you or something but it shows a wish you know to be with you like they feel like they would like to meet you again to see you again so there is this you know would love to see you you know and they will just love you you know that's that's it the intention is you know and some for some people maybe it shows the intent to date you eventually they will call you or something as soon as you have opportunity you know if you at any point had some sort of argument they want to solve this argument and kind of forgive you or they want you to be back together you know something like that also it might indicate you know maybe uh you know two other people or a friend or something helping them out with you when it comes to meeting you or something so basically being friends and forgiving you being partners that's their intention now what's the advice for you regarding this person okay seven of clubs it might indicate to do something yourself like you know do some work yourself when it comes to this person do some sort of action maybe they need something from your side in in order to you know um in this relationship or maybe you know in any case whatever relationship this is it shows that you should also do something you should fight a bit you should do some effort show some effort um, for this relationship to work you can talk about work harder or you know talk more with this person you need to talk you know that sort of thing so okay this is our uh reading number three let's move on to reading number four now what do they think of you right now okay they might think that uh, well right now you're not in contact right now you're somehow not connecting um like right now you're sleeping or something you know it can be that um you're not active right now sleeping or something resting at home you know with the family members and um some sort of coming peaceful quiet and also hmm, that sort of thing can also mean that you don't like uh, some people let's say being with a certain group of people like you don't like being with your family or you don't like being with uh, you know with your friends right now something like that if you're tired or bored or simply don't like can think uh, they might think that you have a secret from you keep a secret from them you know like something is there there is hidden or something like you're afraid of some sort of group of people or maybe you have a social anxiety or even don't talk to your family too much okay what do they feel about you Overall, they, they love you, they like you, and um, there is a sense of friendliness, some sort of stability in the relationship, and common goals. Uh, maybe you belong to the same group or work on the same goal, and that's why they are feeling very friendly towards you. Maybe there is more people, more than just you and them. It could be that there is a group of people working somewhere, and they simply feel 
kind of same friendly about all of them and you included not excluded so to say um, overall the cards are good it shows friendship and growing friendship that you know pretty much lots of happiness and things like that um, this can also indicate some sort of they're happy over some document or message or work that you send them or something like that you know so it depends on the situation now let's have a look what do they what are their intentions towards you okay so basic intentions uh they like you you're in contact everything is great now i don't know if this work or contact or or what or what it is exactly what is between you but the intention is that they might want to send you a message call you and you know talk to you you might be older than them you know uh they might see you as older uh like i don't know 10 years older five years older you know so they simply might think of you and want to send you some communications because you're in contact with them can be they are interested in that document or something that happened between that they are happy about you know okay so what is advice for you regarding this person will it choose um talking learning about this person you can see learn about them more as much as you can um you know get to know each other better it can talk about some sort of communications between you two it can talk about you know asking this person things you know and uh, simply i think make sure that you know about them enough if you want to have a serious relationship so this is our reading number four uh, with our playing cards. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for watching this video and I hope to see you next time. Please share your questions and suggestions for the future videos in the comment section below. Thank you again and bye-bye.